SUDT is a fully featured SEO software designed to serve freelancers, startups, enterprises, and SMEs. It offers content management, rank tracking, auditing, keyword tracking, competitor analysis at just one place. But just before we take a closer look, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel so you stay up to date with all our best of work. SUDT lets you explore the organic and paid traffic of high volume keywords used across any website or any single page. This powerful platform helps you conduct keyword research so you can leverage real-time data to optimize your website. You're also able to pull up web pages with high traffic volume to discover the kind of content that's performing really well. So let's take a closer look at SUDT to see if it's a good alternative to popular content optimization tools like Hrefs, SEMrush and Mango Tools. I'll also leave a link to the lifetime deal in the description below this video. So this is SUDT and as you can see, so this software has got five out of five stars on AppSumo. So this is direct alternative to Hrefs, SEMrush and Mango Tools. So the tier one plan is available for one time purchase of $79 and in this plan you get 2500 web pages then you get 300 keywords then you can add up to 10 competitors and 20,000 backlinks then we have this 250 on demand on site analysis per month then we have this 250 on demand lighthouse analysis per month. So similarly, we have this tier 2 and tier 3 plans as well. If you want to stack more codes, you can go up to tier 5 plans. So I'll just give a link in the description down below. You can just check them out. So once we log in to the SCODT, so this is the home screen here. So first, what you have to do is you have to just click on add project here. So just mention the website and you just have to click on next step. So after that, what you have to do is you have to just select the region here. You can select your language and you can also select desktop or desktop and mobile. So after that, just select the keywords, suggested keywords here for tracking. So I'll just select the keywords here. And once that is done, you just have to click on start analysis. So this is the domain overview here. So here you'll be able to see the domain rank based on backlink reports. Then we have this organic keywords here. Then we have this organic traffic here. Then we have this paid traffic. Then you can find the number of backlinks here. And here you'll be able to see the referring domains. So here, as you can see, this is the organic shares overview. So basically you'll be able to see the traffic percentage in terms of the country. So here you'll be able to see from United States, you are getting 20% traffic and 202 keywords are ranking and you can see the value and the traffic here. So this is the amount of traffic that a country has. So here, as you can see, so from Canada, it's 17%. So there are 33 keywords which are ranking than India 10%. And here, as you can see, so this is top keywords here. So in USA, you'll be able to see like in top 10, there is only one keyword and in top 100. So there are 201 keywords which are ranking. So similarly in UK, you'll be able to find the number of keywords which are ranking in top three, top 10 and top 100. So after that, we'll just go to this organic traffic. So here you'll be able to see the organic traffic here. So this is the new one. This is the lost traffic. Then this is up and here you'll be able to see rank keywords here. So here, as you can see, like, uh, in 51 to 60, there are 38 keywords. Then in the ranking 61 to 70, there are 19 keywords. So these are the rank keywords here and here you'll be able to see all the keywords which are ranking here. So this is the rank here. And this is the change. So here, as you can see, this is up by 14. Then we have this traffic here. So here you'll be able to see estimated traffic volume based on impression. Then we have the search volume here. You'll be able to find the search volume. 
Then also we have this keyword difficulty here. So this is a score from zero to hundred where zero is the lowest and hundred is the highest difficulty. And then we have this CPC here. So you can see different different CPC here. Also, if you want to add any particular keyword to the rank tracker, you can do that directly from here. So you just have to select the keyword from here and you just have to click it here, add to rank tracker. So you can select desktop and mobile. You can select the region here and click on save. So this keyword has been added to the tracker. So the next one is the paid traffic. So this will show you all the paid traffic analysis. Then we go to the on site here. So here we have this audit section. So here you'll be able to see all the errors, warning and notices here. So once you click on errors here, so here, as you can see your content quality, low word count, then we have this social tags. So you can just make the necessary changes here. So then we have this performance tab here. So as you can see the website performance is 92 out of 100. Then we have this keyword cloud here. So here you'll be able to see all the keywords in terms of percentage here. So then we have this content explorer. So here you'll be able to add competitors website and discover which content works for your competitor. And similarly, you can create content which is similar to the competitor's content. So I'll just add one competitor here. So as you can see here, so this are all the competitors pages here and how many keywords are ranking and what's the organic traffic here. So as you can see here, Mother's Day 2022, so the organic traffic is here around 80,000 and there are around 39 keywords which are ranking for that particular page. So similarly, you can actually spy on your competitors and find all the keywords and the amount of traffic that it is getting. So next we have this rank tracker. So in this rank tracker, as you can see, these are all the keywords which are ranking and you can see the particular rank here. So this one, all these keywords are ranking at number seven. Then here, as you can see, this is the change here. So this is up by 40 here. Then we have this keyword difficulty, then CPC is available, then search volume is available for a few keywords here. And the most important part of a SEO tool is keyword research. So here, as you can see, so you just have to enter the keyword. So I've just entered the keyword here and let's check the keyword analysis. So here, as you can see how to grow Instagram account, the, you can find the search volume. Then we have the keyword difficulty here and that's the CPC here. Also, it gives keyword which are very similar here. So I can see here how to grow Instagram art account, how to grow an art Instagram account. You can find similar keywords here. Now let's check keyword ideas here. So once we click on keyword ideas, so this one will give us some ideas, some different different keywords. Let's check related keywords here. So these are all the related keywords like buy Instagram followers, how to get 1K followers on Instagram in five minutes. So these are all the related keywords along with the keyword difficulty, along with the CPC and search volume. So now let's check out backlinks here. So here you'll be able to see all the backlinks. You can spy on your competitors or your own website. So here, as you can see, so these are all the backlinks here. So this is the URL, this is the anchor text here. So this is the status which is active here. And you can see the type of the backlink here, no follow or do follow. You can see the date here, added on. Then we have this PR, page rank and domain rank. So this is similar to page authority and domain authority. Then we can find the referring domains also. So if you need different different domains which are linking to the website. So these are all the referring domains. And here as you can see, so this is the graph here of active backlinks. So this is new and lost backlinks. Overall, I think it's a very good and very affordable SEO tool. It's rare to find such a powerful and useful tool for just a one-time payment of $79. I will give it a four out of five in terms of the overall score for an SEO tool. I believe they have improved the keyword research tool 
and competitive research tool to give you more information about where you stand in comparison to your competitors and to find content gaps like you will find on hrefs but for the most part i believe scdt is a good tool however for the price you are paying and if you can't afford a monthly price for hrefs most or uber suggest i would recommend going out and grabbing the lifetime deal if you want me to do a review comparing this tool to some other seo tools let me know in the comments below and remember you can find a link for scdt in the description below this video so if you like this video give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to our youtube channel for more videos i'll see you in the next video